Traffic check 648 WCCO. Josie, what's it like? For three decades, Minnesotans have been waking up to Dave Lee. Beautiful morning out there in the Twin Cities. Today, they awoke to this. I'm retiring. May 1st, the alarm clock will not be set. April 30th is my last day. At 66, after 32 years at The Good Neighbor, Radio Dave says it's time. You've been thinking about this for a while? I have, you know, probably about a year and a half. This two-week uh, vacation to Italy with wife Julie got Dave thinking. I was sleeping late every day, and I said more. I said, you know what? This isn't too bad. The Hatton, North Dakota native started his career at radio stations in East Grand Forks and Fargo, migrated to the legendary Boone and Erickson morning show after arriving at WCCO, then was handed the keys to Morning Drive himself. All through the job, you meet all these people and at every walk of life. Man, that part's been so fun. The affable host thrived as an interviewer, joining the broadcast teams for Gophers and St. Thomas Sports and the Minnesota Twins. I wanted Minneapolis-St. Paul to be a little bit like my hometown of Hatton, where I could walk down the street, hey, hey, hey. And Soon, more time with Julie. There are three kids and five grandkids. I'm among the many, the many, many who are going to miss you. Well, I am humbled, and I appreciate People putting up with my flawed personality all these years. Tonight, a grateful neighbor. Blessed in many ways. Boyd Hoopert, Carol Evan News. On a personal note, you won't find a more true professional than Dave Lee. His work speaks for itself, and his kind personality does as well. We wish him well in retirement. We have more.